time that would have put him. He really likes this track. He calls this his favorite track on the F1 calendar. And I believe he won back here in season uh, two, I believe it was. And he's looking to see if he can at least pr produce a good result. But Ryan also with a nice fair position on the medium tires. That actually says a lot. Well, 106-1. We'll catch up with many things if he hasn't invalidated his lap time yet. But he goes purple in sector one. There's a slow Alfa Romeo here. He's going to use the slipstream get around him heading into turn number four. Octane out here on an out lap along with Neil. Dan trying again on a timed lap. No, he's invalidated. My goodness, Dan. Keep it in between the white lines. <laughs> Just invalidation after invalidation after invalidation. I feel bad. Caution sector three. I believe that's a driver heading to the pit lane. Yep, that'll be Ryan heading into the pit. Here comes many things. Through the final corner. Can keep it in between the white lines. Shifting late in fourth gear goes top of the chart! A 105.076 yes, for the Alphatari. Bye, ragazzi. <laughs> Let's go. Probably not gonna make it to Q3 anyways. <laughs> what? <laughs> he doesn't think that guy's gonna make it to Q3? Oh my goodness. Good job, Jeremy. 0.477. Many things does not get a time. Neil goes top a 103 857. Hector goes top a 103 723. Dan to third 104 294. Troy goes 103 193. Ooh, look at Troy in the Ferrari. Also, another thing you won't see in 2020. Jesse sixth, a one oh eight. He's four seconds off the pace. We'll catch up with Caden, who's on his first attempt. He did it again. Is, is, is many things gonna have a lap this time? Oh, I know, many things keep it valid. It's very hard for many things Ooh. to keep it within track limits, I guess. It's many things will go fifth. Four. He beat Big Boy yep. by one thousandth of a second. Wow, one one thousand. But I'm sure he'll go out again. Ben, Tyler, TK, all out in Q2. Three drivers we fought that would. It's time to bring the action. We've got. Five red lights, and it is lights out, and away we go. Troy leads us down to the turn turn one. Can he beat Hector into the corner? He'll clear Hector. Ryan around the outside trying to take second. Ryan will actually fall back to fifth. Now into the clutches of Neil. I'm sorry, that's fourth. Back behind Neil. Neil up into third. Scoring's a little messed up right now. We'll get back to that. How about Dan working his way there in fifth, trying to seek and find a way around Ryan. Both of the hash drivers now fourth and sixth. As is McLaren to TK there in seven. A lot of contact going on forever back to hat. Or, I'm sorry, that's a Renault in the grass. That's risky. Trying to hold on to it. Confirmed. How about Aiden into the tenth position in that Mercedes? And all goes and going wide is the Renault. Can he rejoin safely? He does so, I believe so, yes. And forever back, there's a racing point in the back. Octane. Towards the back of the grid. So it's Ferrari, Renault, Alfa Romeo, Haas, McLaren, Haas, McLaren, Racing Point, Mercedes, and Williams. Ben into the top 10 in ninth now as Troy goes fastest on the opening lap. It's a 110.011 on the mediums. DRS is enabled. No, it's not. <laughs> That's what my screen said. I just read it. Somebody said a purple sector one. Markle into the points now in 10, battling many things. Many things falls back to 11th. Risky gets a three second time penalty for multiple warnings. Landon goes to the left. Not as Venti. Three second time penalty for the race leader who's no longer the race leader. Hector goes to the race lead. 
Troy with a three second time penalty. Colton with a three second time penalty. Everybody, why don't they get a three second? There's a, somebody around. I think that's the Afro Mayo of Markle. He was in the points and the three second time penalty for Landon. Get a leave room in. Many things in tryhard mode, and there's contact behind them. I think Landon and Aiden, Adrian are going at it. They're 12. A three second time penalty for killing for cash. The top three still holding nicely. Two seconds, or a second and a half between the top three. Oh, and around goes the Ferrari of Troy! In a pit lane wall! And a 106 8 for Hector on the mediums, but more trouble for Ferrari. Troy A into the pit lane. And TK closing in on Ryan. And this is going to be in an interesting battle for oh. the podium as Risky oh. is getting penalty in contact. And Venti's out of the race. The Ricky punch? could punt me into a wall. Keep an eye on the Delta. We need to keep it positive to avoid a penalty. Slow down, maintain and safe Delta. A new safety car deployed. I don't know how you would send it. I don't know if you. Upload it to YouTube private and send it, or if it's Twitch, or I don't know. Or yeah, yeah well, yeah, yeah. well, I I I only have access to him on uh, PlayStation. Yeah, uh, or you can um, uh, you can send me your Instagram or I don't know any social media you have, and I'll say I'll send the uh. Okay. Just uh, talk after. Uh, yeah, we could we could talk after the race. Uh, yeah. Learn many things from protesting you this race already. Oh wow! Many, many, many things I have, tried uh, to leave you with the no space. response either. I tried to leave you the space, but I mean it could have been my fault too, but we'll see. I don't know. I uh, at some point I had to make the corner. <laughs> Five second penalty for a severe collision with Pappy. Right as that happens, Hector hits the gas, and we're back to racing. Okay, clear. Right on. Make sure it gets to me, and uh, we'll look at. It, especially if it affects finishing results. Killing for cash hits the pit lane again. That really sucks for killing for cash. He incurred some damage on the opening lap, and then oh, Ooh, Dan is going around. Dan back to the 16th position after I didn't see what happened. My only assumption would be either he got hit or he ran wide solo off of turn one and spun round. And how about this battle for nine? Risky Ben Troy. Very risky indeed. How tight it was down the hill to turn four. Three second time penalty for TK, multiple warnings. At third right now, penalty would have him in fifth, but that's if the, the intervals would to stay the same the rest of the race. Troy around the outside on Ben. Ben hitting the pit lane. You get damage out of that or, uh, this would not be a strategy because I have to assume this is wing damage. Danny hit the back of Ryan and then he spun out and oh. I didn't have anywhere to go. But everybody else has held their own landing right now in six, trying to find a way around Caden as Ryan on fresh soft tries to make the best of him. Little wide goes Landon, and that could be some penalties later. We all, we don't already have a book of exceeding track limits and corner cutting penalties to go through. Three second time penalty for Caden for multiple warnings. It depends what tire Caden's going for. Can the mediums? I guess the mediums could go this far. Yes, the mediums could go 24 laps. A little bit of stretch, but nothing, nothing out of the ordinary. 
Octane and many things now duke it oh out for P10. God. Octane really holds Aiden. the spot. Three second time for Dan as Landon really struggling for grip on exit under attack from Markle. Battling down the hill, Landon on seven lap order saw, so you expect Landon in soon. Many things is lighting up that right front tire. That is screaming for mercy on the Alphatari. Yeah, for Mayo, Neil fancies a way around the Alphatari and he'll find his way as many things finds his way to the rally cross track here in Spielberg. Troy holds on in second, he stays on his 11, 11 lap old softs. Ryan Fared, Markle, fourth, Octane, fifth on all nine lap old softs. This battle for fourth rages on 17 and a half seconds behind Hector. You hit me, Octane? Now for a male racing point, race up the hill, both wings intact. Neil fancies to find a way into this battle or maybe through this battle. And we'll see when the Alfa Romeo teammates get together here in this battle, what happens, what transpires with the racing point in the mix. Neil quickly closes, TK on very fresh softs, actually just came off the pit lane on those softs. Many things on those hards. Where does he end up? Already a pit stop behind Hector. So it's not a race winning strategy by any means as Troy hits the pit lane. Oh, contact and a wing glider and around goes Tyler! Neil did not expect Tyler to get pushed into the line of fire from Neil and now Markle sits stricken off of turn eight. He's gonna hit the pit lane. Octane in as well. All three of the drivers in that incident. Wow. Neil beats Octane off the pit lane and Neil on hards. Hey. We'll come in on those 14 lap boat softs and I would assume another set of softs to the end if he's already put on a different set of tires. Nope, it's mediums. You know, Hector went from mediums to softs because he started the race on the mediums. And a set of softs lying in the pits. Room on. Three seconds out in front of TK's four lap old softs. Three second time penalty for Octane. Now, will Hector's softs make it 14 laps? I know Hector loves the fact that I'm saying that. How many laps have I done on my softs? 10. They're at 50%. I'm gonna let you buy in the straight. As Ben hits the pit lane, so throw on another set of softs then. He ends up, though, many things right now in fourth. Those hards last another 12 laps for many things. Ryan trying to dethrone many things his fourth position. Bolton in sixth. Also on hards, but fresher hards than many things. Ducaden on 10 lap old medium tries to chase down the Haas of Colton. Landon in eighth, though. Doing not a fine job, or not a bad job. <laughs> Sorry. For... <laughs> it's brutal out here. <laughs> Not a fine job. Seven second advantage over Troy, who's now cleared the McLaren of TK. And now the battle for fourth is on. Many things on hards to Ryan's very fresh mediums around the outside. It's not even a battle. Ryan gets the fourth. Octa I'm sorry, many things fights back. Wow, what a move. And now this is going to be about to watch as Markle gets a three second time penalty oh, down in 12. Bitch. Ryan trying to close that gap on many things. Ryan is easily going to get around him. Now it's going to be Hal. Many things right now. Oh, Ryan! 
Ben into the gravel, holds on to it. Ben goes by for fifth. See how Ben and a three second time penalty for many things. See where Ben takes the lunch, you go left on many things up the hill. Three second time penalty for Dan. Ben will clear for P4. Ash Driver is sitting sixth and seventh. The battle for fifth rages on still. Watching TK, can he go fastest here? And he won't, so I don't think TK's gonna have a shot at fastest lap. The battle for fifth now. Many things desperately trying to hold on for a top five. Gap to car in front is 10. Here comes Ryan. He's gonna look for the launch. He's not gonna do it behind them. Caden on Colton for seven. Neil wants in that battle as well. Neil in the points. The lunge peaking. No, nothing from Ryan yet. Being very patient with many things. Coming around to five laps to go this time. But actually, that was the last time. But coming around to four laps to go this time. Actually, Hector's already started four laps to go. The these drivers 35 seconds back. Ryan, does he have fifth on many things? He's clear of many things. Will many things be able to fight back? He's going to have a lack of grip here through the double right. Five and six, nothing through seven, nothing. Many things looks like he'll lose the top five here. Five Back here, the battle continues with many things for sixth. Neil wants sixth on many things. He looks to the left side. The driver's left, right side of your screen, up the hill, he'll clear many things into turn three. Many things locks up those that right front tire, still screaming for mercy, but only two laps left this time by as Hector only has to navigate 18 more corners. Looking for his 15th win in his career, being one away from tying and, and Darius in the league. Have a time for seventh all time. He's through the final corner and only one a win away from that. Hector will win the Austrian Grand Prix. Troy comes to the final corner. And Troy will come home second position in that Ferrari. TK now works through the last sector. TK will go third pending time penalties. TK comes home third. Ben on time penalties will come home fourth. Now Ryan under attack from Neil. Last two corners. Ryan trying to fend off Neil. Will it come down to penalties, though? Off the final corner, Ryan takes the defensive line. Ryan finishes fifth, Neil sixth. Penalties don't change that. Colton comes home seventh. Many things gets Colton seventh on penalties. Markle comes home ninth. Markle goes eighth on Colton. Octane stays tenth on penalties. And can Dan change that, though? No. <laughs> Dan trying to get a point. No. Not with his time penalties. Caden goes 11th on time penalties. Landon will cross the line. Last car on the lead lap. Can he get at least 12th on penalties? I don't think Landon would anyway. Landon will get 13th on penalties. Over on down. Yeah, other, other than Venti, but Venti only completed 7 laps anyway. But Ryan, the only driver not to have a time penalty to his name. How about that? Hector, Troy, TK, the top three. And uh, would you look at the time? We're finishing right when we finished last season. <laughs> anyway, nice. uh, yep. <laughs>